welcome back to Book Club Preview. And this is the last chapter of Warriors, The Forest of Secrets, chapter 30. And whew, there's still a little bit of um, some extra twists in the story uh, for this last chapter. And uh, it starts off with White Storm going up to Fireheart saying, well, deputy, what's your what are your orders and fireheart's kind of like oh shoot i'm i'm the deputy and white storm does this with respect and um he's like well what, what would what would tiger claw do <laughs> oddly enough he thinks what would tiger claw do he says um food we need food okay you guys go get food um we we need to patrol we need to make sure that there's no rogue cats and we need to go get even more food so go get some food go get some food and he starts giving orders and Darkstripe, he says, Darkstripe, go find some cats and uh, go get some food. Darkstripe gets long tail and I think dust pelt. And he looks, but before he does that, he looks at Fireheart like, I'm not going to take orders from a kitty pet. And Fireheart looks straight back at him. And then finally dust pelt goes and does it. And so he starts giving orders and uh, feels, whew, okay, clan life is getting back to normal. Um... He's hanging out with Cinderpaw, and Cinderpaw says, I'm going to go bring Blue Star some food and then check on her wounds. So she grabs a, a bird, and as she's walking, she spits it out. Oh! And then out of the bird, and I think it's actually a crow or a raven, there are maggots. Maggots are like the babies of flies, the little worms, and the food smells terrible. She's like, oh, crow food? Crow food mixed with fresh food? What does this mean? And then Cinderpaw and Fireheart like wonder, is this an omen of Cinderpaw bringing Blue Star crow food and maybe Star Clan trying to tell Blue Star something? But they like, no, no, it can't be. Um, Fireheart says, I'm going to go bury this. Don't tell anyone about it. Now, before they can even really get peace back into Thunder Clan, the River Clan warriors come back. And this time, Fireheart kind of nods with respect to Leopard Fur. And Leopard Fur sees, oh, he's not nodding to me like a normal warrior, something different. But she can't really flesh that out yet. She says, We've come back to talk to Blue Star. And so Fireheart goes to Blue Star, and Blue Star says, Oh, Fireheart, good, you're here. We need to talk. She says, uh, Not yet. River Clan warriors are here to talk about the kits. Blue Star says, Okay, come on. And she goes out to talk about to the River Clan warriors. And they they say, we want the kits, we're gonna take them back today. And Blue Star says, no, you can't have the kits, we'll fight to keep these kits. And um, there, there's some, there might be a little bit of battle there, but then Graystripe says, no, no. They're almost like, what? what, what's going on? And he goes up to Blue Star and he says, Leopard Fur is right. The kits belong to River Clan. And Fireheart's like, whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? Man, you can't give up your kits. He says, no, no, Fireheart, just let me do this. Blue Star, they're right. I will give them the kits. Blue Star's like, wow, are you sure? You, you can't turn back from this. He says, no, no, let's do it. And so he says, okay, Leopard Fur, uh, we'll give the cats to you, the kits, and we'll give them um, to you, I think, at night or the next day. Um, at the stepping stones and so that leopard fruit's like whoa, whoa um, okay okay cool and they take off the next day or at that time later that night whatever um, gray stripe is getting the kits from the mom that's been taking care of them and she says farewell my beloveds which is farewell my loves you know she's been caring for these kits for a few weeks maybe and probably feels like they're her own and Fireheart's like, man, come on, don't do this, Graystripe. He's like, please, just trust me. Can you help me? Can you take one of the kits and bring them with me to River Clan? Fireheart says, okay, but just thinking, like, maybe I can talk him out. And so they take the kits over to uh, the river, and that's when Graystripe drops a bomb, and he says, look, I'm gonna go with the kits to River Clan. What? And he says, I've got no loyalty left in my heart for ThunderClan. They don't want me. And I'm going to go with my kids to RiverClan. And Fireheart can't understand this. But at the same time, 
he does understand and he wants to protest he wants to argue but he just says okay I I can't I can't argue there's nothing I can say man I'm gonna miss you you're my best friend I need you but go and so uh, Graystripe takes the kits he goes out of the river clan misty foot is there they grab the kits and they say goodbye and Fireheart just thinks he just stays there watches him leave and he thinks never again never again am I gonna hunt in the woods with Graystripe am I gonna play fight with him are we gonna share tongues <sighs> goodbye buddy and he kind of goes back to Thunder Clan and he feels a little bit sad but as he's going he he starts to feel this energy this new power and he just thinks man I'm I'm a deputy now. I've got, I've got a new life, new responsibilities, new honor. And he kind of feels more proud. And as he's going up the hill to ThunderClan, the sun is setting and whoo, it's all red behind him. And he's just standing there running to his new life as the deputy of ThunderClan. And that is how book three ends. Whew. Oh, man, I can't believe that. Vocabulary. Number one, non-committal <laughs> means not committing, which is saying like, maybe? <laughs> and so I think Fireheart says, uh, this will change. And when Brightstorm says, uh, maybe, gives a mm, non-committal grunt. Uh, the other vocabulary word here is cope. Cope means to handle, to be able to take care of. So this is saying the kids are now old enough to cope, to handle, to deal with the journey to River Clan. That leaves us with our discussion question. Do you think Graystripe made the right choice? <sighs> Leaving Thunder Clan and joining River Clan and giving the kids to River Clan. And of course, please make your own discussion question. That is all the time we have for today. Thank you so much for joining me for reading Warriors, The Force of Secrets. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.